<gasps> hmm. Is it a bit too close or is it how it usually is? Oh, <laughs> Please, can you sing that every week? <laughs> Merry Christmas, rocking around. <laughs> you didn't like my Christmas song, uh, so you're like, I want to sing my own. Uh... Merry Christmas, everyone. everyone. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, so cute. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Welcome back to the Jab Welcome. Doll. Welcome. My name is Luke. My name is Deepa. And today is Christmas. <laughs> Watching the Doctor Who Christmas Special 2017. Oh. Twice upon a time. Wow. Whoa. It's the last one for a while, Christmas. Yeah, and you know what? I really am quite devastated. Are you? Yeah. Don't worry, they're back now. In huh? present day, they're back. Oh, okay. There's something really about doing it. Christmas not at Christmas. It's been really fun. Yeah. Someone at work today was like, what are you up to this evening? And I was like, how do you even explain? <laughs> <laughs> how do you even begin to start? Like, yeah. Mm, it's Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> Me and my friend like, are going to give each other Christmas stuff. Yeah. At Christmas in July. Yeah. We're going to watch Christmas things and listen yeah. to Christmas songs. We sound like we need to be locked <laughs> up. Obviously, when it's actually Christmas... There's a big build up. You're listening to so many Christmas songs. It does get a bit repetitive for me. Um, Unacceptable. But then, like Christmas in July, it's, it's just not, like it's we've just... had a few in July. Yeah, we have. It's obviously like the pattern. Yeah. Watch Matt Smith regenerate in July because he has a line in it where he says it's July, and we were both like, <gasps> it is. Oh, we got to say something. <laughs> we were like, it is July. <laughs> so like, it happens oh, a lot. Yeah. Christmas in July, Aww. and then this is the last one. <gasps> <laughs> I listened to a bit of Christmas music on the way down to Brighton and Simone was so did. angry. She was like, it's July! I was like, it, it's fine. Christmas music's allowed whenever in yeah, Luke's car. Yeah, I love it. Good. Mm. <laughs> this is it really endless. It happens every time. <laughs> like, put your drink on. <laughs> Should you present? <prezzies>? Yeah! <laughs> I feel good, are you? Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas. Open Christmas. with a big smile. Bigger, oh, oh my god, god. that's actually quite big. It was, wasn't it? Uh, <laughs> it's on my neck. neck. <laughs> I felt like a shark, you know, like, you know, they like have too much teeth. Take your tits. <laughs> <laughs> it's Christmas. <laughs> I like scribbled birthday out and just put. Become... <laughs> love that it's where'd creepy. you get that from um, just the card factory really yeah so i went in there and i was like half tempted to ask if they'd already got the christmas stock in and whether it was in the back i was like really tempted but then i thought it's not mm, a bad shout yeah, i would never think a card to shop do might that. now yeah because like retail christmas starts in august that's soon. Yeah. So I was like, they might. Yeah. But then I thought, no, you are going to look like a right fucking <laughs> You are going to have to specimen. explain. Yeah. So I was like, I'll go to the funny cards and I'll see what I can make do. Mm. But even the funny cards that were just, there was a bit that said humour. And I thought, yeah, I'll go to humour. Mm. All of it was birthday related. Oh. I was like, that's so weird. I yeah. thought humour would just be generic yeah, jokes. Because cards aren't all for but birthdays, are they? it was all fucking they? birthday. And I was like, wow. I'm just going to scribble shit out. That's what I've done with your other cars. It's like, yeah, yeah well. I really like to shake your tears. I love that. <laughs> oh my god, stop. Is it going to smell good? It might smell shit for you. So I like the smell, which actually might mean you hate the smell. <gasps> Cherry blossom. Cheryl blossom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I quite like it, Are Eva. You sure? Yeah, I do. Are you know. sure? Yeah. Should we light it now? <gasps> oh my god. Cherry yeah. blossom. Oh my god! Do you? No, but I really wanted the second volume. Yes! <laughs> I really wanted it. He's so sexy. <laughs> I have such a thing for this man. Bye. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> well, I wish I had my dumb rap. <laughs> god, can you guess what it is? <laughs> can you guess what it is? <laughs> oh, oh, you did it. I did. Thank you. Waterstone. Yeah, there are Waterstones voucher for you to buy like any book of your That's choosing. That's a pretty voucher. It was the winteriest one I could I find. I liked that. And again, they all said happy fucking birthday. <laughs> and I was like, God. Uh, I know your birthday is in July, but Jesus. Can we have some Christmas as well? Shake your tits, it's Christmas. Yeah. The fact that that jacket, which I bought for fancy dress, was too big for me is hilarious <laughs> that Deeper is now wearing it. 
Last week, it wasn't last week, it was a couple of weeks ago, we finished series 10 of Doctor Who. But yeah, we had two masters last week. Yeah. The master and Missy. And they're dead. They killed each other. Drama. I mean, there wouldn't have been any other way for them Honestly. to have gone. Like, it was so... It's on brand yeah. for them. Yeah. The Doctor is, like, regenerating. But he's kind of, like, refusing all at the same time. Well, sure. Yeah. And she let it be. Bill was a Cyberman, but now she's a puddle girl. And oh she's God, off yeah, flying with stars as a lesbian. Wild. Yeah. She met this puddle girl once. Well, she realises, I don't like this girl. And she's just imagine? stuck with her. That's the spin-off I would like to see, though. Like, just like the outer space lesbian drama. Yeah, of, and she's like, just like, fuck's sake, I'm just EastEnders, stuck with her. EastEnders-style arguments. Yeah. I would love. And they just keep coming out of puddles, like, oh, again. <laughs> Narda always, like, protecting the children on the ship, but they will eventually all be killed by Cybermen. Actually, such a depressing episode. Nothing good came out of that. It really didn't. It was sad. And yes, and then the Doctor's regenerating and he stopped his regeneration. And then out of the snow came the very first Doctor. He was like, you're not the Doctor, I'm the Doctor. So the 12th Doctor has met the first Doctor now. So we had two Masters, now we've got two Doctors. You wait. Mm. You wait till the end of this episode. No, stop it, Lou. When the 7,000 Daleks come out of the ground. Oh, God. No, but if there is actually <laughs> then you Dalek, would never come back. I'd be like, we've just done two episodes of Cybermen. Yeah. They actually can't do Daleks. It's one or the other. Actually, no, they've had two at the same time, they've haven't had, they? They've had a few episodes where they've been in it at the same time. Yeah, what am I talking about? It's like but, I forget what's happened. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Master appears. <laughs> <like, "Hey." laughs> Um, but I watched this film yesterday with Kira and I was crying by the end of it and I was literally oh. like that was such a good film babe and he was like you never watched that film <laughs> <laughs> nothing stays does it and literally was just like you have to delete I to make thought, room for more no it really is and I was like oh yeah I thought I recognised <laughs> shall we watch it then check your tits it's Christmas previously oh. on Doctor Who oh wow yeah we're going back 709 episodes I know him. You do? Yeah. He's the first Doctor. I love old Doctor Who. It's so funny. It's just crazy how old it is. I know. Oh my gosh. It's actually scarier. Have you no emotions, sir? What's happened to you, Doctor? What do you know of regeneration? But he's not experienced it before. Something has gone very wrong. Hello? I don't suppose either of you is a doctor. You're trying to be funny. Yeah. <laughs> I Hitler. <laughs> no, <laughs> I get the vibe. It doesn't look like Hitler, but it's not. <laughs> I was like, this is so random. <laughs> and do you know who else showed up? Hitler. <laughs> I would go around licking all the snowflakes. Oh my god, yeah. Literally the whole time I was thinking, I would just like sit my just tongue out. Mouth. Like, yes. I would run. I oh, see, I would fuck you up a bit, wouldn't it? It's like Bernard's watch. Do you remember Bernard's watch where he could press it and everyone would stop? Yeah. He could like cheat and test. It's like the thing with the 50p as well. Yeah, Queen's nose. The Queen's nose! Queen's nose? Queen's head. His head. I don't know. Either of you is a doctor. You try to be funny. <laughs> State your planet of origin and your intention. <laughs> a level five civilization. You might be in for a sub. My TARDIS. Look at my TARDIS. Have I been burgled? <laughs> well, you're an officer from World War One. What do you mean? One. Oh, sorry. Spoilers. <laughs> Enough of this. Snap. He looks really old there. What the doc- oh, yeah. doctor? Assume that I'd get younger. I am younger. <laughs> it's me calling him old as well. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. I would have been happy if it just ended like that. <laughs> That's <laughs> so boring. No, I enjoyed that. <laughs> no, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just rate that five out of five. <laughs> we offer you a gift. Return to us the human you 
demon on your TARDIS, and in exchange, you may speak with her again. Young lady, who are you? It was River. Oh. Is the doctor here? How did this happen? What are you doing? Just keep staying busy. My friend Bill Potts was turned into a cyberman so the people she barely knew could live. Nobody imitates Bill Potts. Nobody mocks Bill Potts. But long story short, I tell you, Paul. You, you did what? <laughs> Hello. And how did you get here? I can't. You can't remember Avenger Khan. Who has been stealing the faces of the dead? Oh. I would love one of those I've been too. I'd feel so fancy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sunglasses. They're sonic. Indoors. We are what awaits at the end of every life. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. Every you so that's what Bill Potts says. Of the human race. Is it Bill Potts? I'm so confused. <laughs> I will stop all of you. Who the hell do you think you are? The Doctor. <laughs> I am the Doctor. See who you will become. The Doctor has moved in blood. What, what was that? To be fair, they cut out all the jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that. I would die. I'd actually faint and then fall and die. Ooh, it's very white. It is, back in the day. Very surgical. <laughs> it's like a rock star. What are they doing out there, though? They want to find a big database that's going to tell them who the glass people are. And he thinks this planet's got the database. Not with those things running around. <laughs> I hope we spend years laughing about it. Do you first stop looking at me? Oh my god. <laughs> Is it her? That's a good question. Out of the shell. Alright. It's me after going up the stairs. <laughs> well, now I refuse to regenerate. It catches up with you. It's like a big lunch. <laughs> that I can relate with. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sexy <so> sassy. <laughs> Bring it to the runway. People don't believe there could be any such thing as a good Dalek. Like they've just done Cybermen, they won't do Dalek. You taught me to hate the Daleks. It's quite a softly spoken Dalek. Yeah, it? it's quite I nice don't for you, isn't it? <laughs> you like, keep it down. Why are you here? Never mind. <laughs> we just needed to understand you, Doctor. I knew it wasn't her. He has to get back into the spot. Yeah. He can't just go. No, he has to be like placed back where he was for time to continue. Captain Archibald Hamish, Lethbridge Stewart. Do you remember Kate Stewart, who's in charge of unit? Her dad was the brigadier, who was a very big part of old Doctor Who. This guy's basically his granddad. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Just a nice little nod to. Oh, lovely. Yeah. I love it when they link, link them all. Finally. Yeah, finally, it's this fucking Christmas. <laughs> About time. Christmas carols. <laughs> Bold. <laughs> Very. So, like, this actually happened. There was a war, and the Germans and the English sang a Christmas carol together and stopped fighting for a bit. Did that actually? Yeah, there was a Sainsbury's Christmas advert about it once as well. Wow. How weird is that? Why it's kind of cute. The power of Christmas. Yeah. And then they go kill each other after. How sad. Yeah. They come together just for Christmas. How cute. 
Lovely. So those glass things weren't evil. No, nothing really. The doctor just always assumes that someone's trying to take over the world, but I think he learnt a little lesson. Well, I feel like that was the first one they won. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there were two TARDISes as well. Yeah, it's cute. Is it TARDISes or TARDI? <laughs> it was regenerated lying down in the old days. Look out for them. Yeah, I prefer to regenerate lying down. They always stand up in New Doctor Who. It looks so much cosier in the old days. <laughs> <laughs> this is literally the longest regeneration. It is ever. ever. Our life is just memories. I'm all our memories. I'm going to prove to you how important memories are. Merry Christmas, Doctor. Thinking. Where is he? Mm. Hello, oh, sir. the trio. Trio. We can be everyone. We are everyone. That's so creepy. Now I'm all made of glass, not just my nipples. Yeah, they got my hair a bit wrong there. I really love that they got a proper goodbye. <laughs> they did need a proper goodbye. They didn't did, they? didn't they? That's so healing. Mm. And he remembers Clara now. That's pretty special. Never be cruel, never be cowardly. And never ever eat pears. Who's he talking to? The next doctor. It's literally me when I'm drunk. <laughs> Flailing about on the floor. <laughs> talking talking to nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm never gonna see this. Oh, as, God, I always see. ruin you all the do. moments. I'm never gonna see this scene the same way again. God. It is very dramatic, isn't it? They love the drama on this show. I don't even know who it's gonna be. <laughs> is it the woman? <laughs> I feel weird. I can't believe we're here. This is the first doctor you knew about. I knew about. Yeah. So I knew there was a woman coming, but she's here. <laughs> but what a traumatic start. I swear she can't fall out. I thought there was a thing. She's gone. <laughs> Is that her just gone now? She's going to regenerate. She, when she hits the floor, new doctor. That's it. <laughs> yeah, it always takes a while. It does. Oh. Yeah. Oh. It, it's just weird because like, this is the first one that... Was on your radar, I, right? Yeah. So yeah. like when we first started reacting, I started paying... Not paying attention, but like obviously I just knew Doctor Who was More happening. Aware. Yeah. Whereas before I lived in a cave and I didn't know. You didn't. I literally just you didn't. I didn't see anything Doctor Who related apart from David Tennant. Yes. I knew Yeah, he was the the poster boy. But like <laughs> when we first started reacting, that was the last episode I'd seen. Wow. So we've gone for like full circle. Like this, you're now where I was when yeah. I showed you the show. I think, I think that's the weird. That's really thing. weird, isn't it? Because we did like two or three Chris Frecklestons, and then I went to America and I watched her first episode in America. Wow. And we'd only done like two or three. Really that's, weird. That's weird. That's yeah, really odd. Because it's literally like I couldn't have even imagined being where you were. Yeah. And now we're there. And now we're we're there. You're where I was. That's so full circle to my brain. Wow. I can't believe it. That was the longest regeneration. So, like, I felt like when it actually happened, it wasn't as, like... It's not a big shock, is it? Because no. you know it's coming the whole freaking time. So, like, time. obviously him changing into her, like, is a shock. But the actual regeneration itself... Yeah, you were like, I feel like, a while. Yeah, and, like, I feel like we'd seen, we saw the fake one. We saw, like, there were so many different regeneration scenes that yeah, we saw. Yeah, they, like, tease this one for, like, yeah. two, three episodes. So I felt like when that actually happened, you it, like, didn't, it didn't really phase me that much. Yeah. It was a bit like, okay, here we go. So it's like, I have a love-hate relationship with this episode. Mm. Because I really like 
I think there's something really nice about Stephen Moffat and Peter Capaldi. I can tell you Peter Capaldi's leaving now as well. I didn't. Want, I knew you knew he was regenerating, but I didn't want you to know that it was both their last episode, just in case he hung around for a bit and held regeneration off for a whole series. I don't know what was going on in your head, but they're both gone. Stephen Moffat and Peter Capaldi's last episode, I kind of like that it's like there's no real drama and it's just like, mm. it was kind of nice vibes. He got to spend some time with his first self. Him and Bill and Nardole got to say goodbye. He's got Clara's memories again. What a nice way to die. Yeah. As brutal as that sounds. Yeah. Then there was no alien invasion. There was no armies. There was no explosions. There was yeah, no... Even the Dalek was a nice Dalek. It was a nice Dalek. Yeah. So part of me is like, oh, that's actually like, it's actually quite sweet that mm. that's how Stephen Moffat decided to go out because obviously the finale, he'd done the war. He'd done yeah, the explosions. we had quite a So he was able episode. to just like tie the bow. Um, but sometimes I just find it a bit boring. Mm. So I'm in like a love hate. I see what you mean. It. Like even halfway through that episode, I said to you, like, "Oh, it's a big build." Yeah, and then and it I felt really like it was anything. Yeah, anyway. so I felt like it was building to something that I thought was going to really stress me out. Yeah, but then okay. in the end, it was kind of like, "Oh, so those glass people actually just fine. They're fine because they could have. They could have been very powerfully. They scary. because they can." turn into anyone yeah they could have twisted they that anyone. they can time travel mm. they can pull you out of your so death they, they could, like yeah, whoa they could twist that and like be the face of someone they love yeah i think we've had an episode like that we have we've had shapeshifters yeah. and things before yeah but it, it could have been like that um but then yeah we have just had a really difficult episode yeah, so it was that. actually quite nice that we had our goodbyes with characters yeah and That's the thing. I guess in the end of the day, the, this episode was more of a character piece than mm. a story-driven story. Yeah. It was more just him having a farewell moment. He got to see the Daleks before he regenerated because mm. they're the iconic monster. And he got to see all his companions, Clara, Nardo, and Bill, mm. were all in his final episode. And I guess There's that is nice his things. final... Yeah. It, it closes that chapter nicely for this new Doctor that's come new about. Doctor to start, yeah. Um, so proper end of era stuff. Yeah, and that really did feel like the end of something. Yeah. Whereas, like, some seasons, it doesn't necessarily yes. feel like the end of a season. For sure, and things are left open, yeah. and there's still some... But other than the fact that she's literally falling out of the TARDIS, there's yeah. nothing, like, left open no. story-wise. Um, it's all brand new. So the next episode, in theory, is sort of designed that... Which they always try to do with new Doctors every now and again. But the next episode is sort of designed that if you wanted to start watching Doctor Who for the first time, mm. you probably could I was just about on. to say, yeah, like that closes everything off quite nicely. Yeah. That you could actually just start yeah. from yeah. that season. We've done Cybermen, Daleks and Masters all in that finale. And it's like all the big stuff's been done. Wow. Regeneration's been done. Companions are all dead, but they're also not. Move on. So, yeah, the next one is like f real fresh start where we are right now. I'm just intrigued to see what this female doctor. I'm excited. It's gonna be like it's just, it's gonna be just so different. It's gonna change the dynamic so much because yeah. we've only ever seen a male doctor. Yeah, and also like, without getting too like political and stuff about it, but they've always just been like white mm. men. Yeah, roughly the same sort of ages. I know we've had some older like Peter and some mm. younger like Matt, but they've all sort of been. You know, just white male, white men, men yeah. of a certain bracket. Yeah, this is the big change up having Jodie Whittaker. And it's like, like it is insane when you see it because you're just like, wow, yeah, yeah, of course, yeah, it's mad. It's so... mad. It took the show from 1963 to 2017 to actually wow, do that. 2017. Yeah, God. that's crazy. Oh. What an what an episode because we have just. Although not the best episode of Doctor Who, mm. we've ended a big chunky bit of Doctor Who. I don't know Who. what to rate that one. I'm exactly the same because I have, like I said, I have such a love hate relationship with it. I think it's so. There's something really like beautiful about I it. I think 3.5. Me too. Because. Yeah, I guess not much happened, but I do appreciate all the loose ends. Loose ends. Yeah, I give it three point five as well. Cause like it wasn't bad, and like there were parts that were actually really yeah. nice with the old Doctor. Yeah, so cute. And like Peter Capaldi, and it was just like that kind of like him being like, "Why have you got that screwdriver or whatever?" Yeah, and I like love all that. of those. So like, I like really like those moments. Yeah. And I think 
if it weren't for those moments, it probably would have been a way worse episode. Yeah, but agreed. it was just like having them together. Yeah. For me, I love. Better. I really love the. I really love the ending chunk. I love him actually managing to say goodbye to his companions mm. because last week's was rough. Mm-hmm. It was nice that they got a proper like farewell. And then I I love the regeneration oh the God, I feel like I ruined that whole Jody. scene oh. where he was literally like I was like who is he talking to I mean, his speech goes on it's a long speech I remember just like I like I didn't zone out but I was kind of like wait He's talking, talking and who to? is he talking to? Because he's in that box by himself. Yeah. Yeah, and it's like, well, you, yeah. how are you even talking to your future self when you haven't even regenerated yeah. yet? No, no. I just love the the her first scenes because I love that all, all she said about it was that it was brilliant. That was all she said because I was so worried mm. when watching it that it was going to be. Oh my god, I'm on one minute. Like I thought her first right, word, yeah. and I was a bit like worried about it. I was like, oh god, it's going to be really like. Although it is a really like we were saying it crazy it's taken that long and it is a cool thing that they finally changed it Mm. up i was a bit worried that that was all it was going to be script wise that they were gonna like the doctor was literally gonna be like oh about time yeah look how amazing i am and i was really worried that the first female doctor was going to be written in that sort of like way in her first scene and i was going to be like oh cringe cringe, but actually the fact that she just said that it was brilliant i was like that's enough yeah and like the way where like you see her reflection on that thing i think that was really good yeah you never actually saw her for quite a while because even though you were like is it the woman because i was like like, like, her I, like, yeah, I yeah. was like, there's something very feminine about that, but I don't yeah. want to... Because it could just be a feminine man. Yeah, like, some men have really lovely eyelashes. They do, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then, like, yeah, there was, like, a close-up of her eye, but then, yeah, then the reflection, and, like, mm. I just love the build-up to actually seeing, like, her face. Yeah. I just think it's really well-directed mm. as, like, a uh, doctor's first scene. Yeah. But, yeah, I'm excited. Um, the next episode is very aptly called The Woman Who Fell to Earth. Wow. Because okay. she's a woman and she'd be fallen. She's fallen. Okay. Um, wow. I literally yeah. have no idea what to expect. I don't know, like, who the companion's going to be. No. Like, I literally, like, I... Anything could happen. I don't even know who the companion is. Like, even though I'd seen... Her. Her. I don't remember... The who... attachments. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. It's a new era. It's very exciting. Interesting. It's a new showrunner, new writers, okay. new everything, and even the guest writers aren't the same. This has like wow. been a proper refresh, like because normally we had Russell T Davis and he left, and Stephen Moffat took over. Stephen Moffat took a lot of the guest writers, so the vibe was very much the same. But Chris Chibnall, who's taken over now, mm. oh, my stum. <laughs> Chris Chibnall who's taken over now fresh start new writers no one's borrowed no one's written Doctor Who before other wow. than him he's written a few but his team is like brand new so it's proper fresh energy okay and I'm intrigued to see go. what you're going to think of the future of Doctor Who but yeah I can't believe we're here I can't believe we're at Jodie Whittaker I'm so excited she's so Jody cute Whittaker. I've got to stop talking about her because you'll just find out eventually <laughs> Jesus um, wow whoa I feel weird. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Leave spoiler-free comments, but like you mm. can talk about the whole of Peter Capaldi's journey now. Yeah, yeah. You can talk about everything. Let's discuss. Discuss everything 12th Doctor related downstairs. <laughs> click like, click the bell, and we'll see you next week for a fun little Q&A and the week after for the woman who fell to earth. Merry Christmas. Oh, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Da 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 da